First of all, congratulations. Thanks. Um, so we're kind of curious, why why did you decide to steeple this year? Uh, you know, it, it was just something new and exciting to try. Given the last year, you know, I struggled with injuries. I kind of wanted something that maybe took a little bit of the pressure off, put more fun into the sport. And in addition to that, it's kind of a family tradition now. Like my sister and both my cousins do it, so I had to join the club. How smooth did you feel in that heat? Uh, it felt really good, you know. It was a PR, but... <laughs> Um, it felt smooth and like I still have something left for Saturday. Yeah, what number of steeple is this? How many of you are on the That trip? was um, three. Three? Number three. Are you getting more comfortable with the event the more yeah. you do it? Yeah, definitely. You know, each one gives me a lot more experience. Uh, you know, like last time it doubled and this time it's added another 33%. So. Um, it's it's one of those races that you can practice and practice for it, but nothing can quite emulate the race perfectly. So it's really important to get that sort of experience. Now that you've qualified for the final in the 3K, will you also still consider doubling in the 5K? I know you're entered in that. Uh, yeah, well, the 5K is the last event, you know, last race of the season. And so I don't really see any reason other than something medical to not give it a go. Did you ever consider, I mean, in the steeplechase, there's sort of a little bit more pounding on the feet with the water jump and coming down on the barriers. Given your like history of injuries, did you ever consider not doing it because of that reason? No. no. I mean, uh, I think that the actual racing part is such a small percentage of the impact on your body that it's not going to make a noticeable difference. Mm -hmm. and who, are your, who are your cousins? Uh, Mariah and Riley Burroughs. They both run for University of Alaska Anchorage. When did you start hurdling and officially decided to do the steeple? Well, I don't mean to brag, but I was <laughs> third place in the Kenai Peninsula Borough Middle School Championships 100 meter hurdles race really? when I was in eighth grade. So it's kind of a big deal. I'm surprised you guys didn't know that already. <laughs> yeah. we, we knew, we didn't want to, you know. Yeah, but I, I, did, I did hurdles in middle school and did the 300 hurdles a little bit in high school too. So I had some hurdling experience, but um, no water jump or anything really like the steel chase. So, so you, next year you might run the 400 hurdles? Is that the plan? No? Um, it's right in between, you know? Sure. <laughs> Have you always been able to, I mean, I guess, has hurdling come naturally to you? Because usually most athletes are in the steeple on as, as short as you are. Yeah. yeah, well, I mean, our hurdles are pretty short. They're 30 inches, right? So I just think it's, it's not so much about height. It's just about form and getting your legs up. You don't even really have to jump. How much do you hurdle during the week? Um, like, actually jumping hurdles, probably once. Like once ever in practice, or once? Oh, once, once a week, like, going up to a race oh, okay. that I'm going to steeple at. What are your thoughts on the final? Uh, I think that there are a lot of girls that have run faster times towards the end of the season. At the beginning of the season, it kind of looked like it was going to be a weak steeple year, but after seeing the prelims, it looks like everyone has a lot to give for the final, and I'm excited to duke it out. So you said that you wanted to do the steeplechase to you know, mix things up, make it more fun. Do you feel like this year has been more fun and more fun for you? Yeah, and I mean, this is my first outdoor track season in college, and it really has been a lot of fun, and I've enjoyed the experience with the team. Each season is a little bit different than the others, and this outdoor season has been really great. And I'm so excited that I have two other teammates here, and one of my teammates, Claire O'Brien, is in the 5K with me. So it's really cool to have the team aspect, even in an individual sport. Good luck. Thank you. Right, congratulations. Thank you.